Last spring, I moved to an old house in the countryside. I hoped for a quiet life, but instead I stumbled upon another world hidden beneath our own. It was a world of dark fey magic few had ever seen. I met a young girl named Fiona, who was trapped by an evil creature called the Shade. I saved her, and now Fiona is under my care. Even as I hug Fiona close, I know she is still in danger. The Shade wants to cast an eternal winter and rule over our world. Fiona and all other human beings born with magic stand in his way. Fiona told me her teacher, Ms. Thomas, can help her stop the Shade. We've arrived at Fiona's old school to look for her. I can only hope we're not too late. It began when feathers fell from the sky. I felt a strange foreboding, just like when I first met the Shade. The artifact you must find is called the Proof of Undying Love. Beware, it is guarded jealously by a pixie. For centuries, the pixie has trapped unwitting travelers who have strayed towards her enchanted mountain. She will not let go of this artifact easily. You must find a way to use her magic against her. The real Ms. Thomas was safe and sound, but our relief was temporary, for we still had a tough battle ahead of us. Ms. Thomas was captured by the doppelganger before she could finish her work to learn about the origin of the Shade. She was looking for an elder fae, a magical being older than mountains and forests. Only they know the Shade's secrets. As autumn leaves started to fall, we knew what we had to do. We must find this Elder Fay and finish what Ms. Thomas started, no matter what it takes. Ms. Thomas was looking for an Elder Fay, a powerful being that knew the origin of the Shade. This Fay had hidden himself in an abandoned railway station. We must be clever if we want him on our side. As the autumn wind began to blow, we knew eternal winter would not be far behind. Soon, Fiona and I would set off on another journey. But first, a cup of tea and a